Shaky video. It looks unprofessional and sloppy. It makes you sick and dizzy. It seems that the cameraman is no good and the footage is unbearable. Sounds familiar? There are many ways to stabilize your video out there. There is software stabilization, a built-in optical stabilization in the lens, or the sensor shifting stab built into the camera. Finally, there is a physical external stabilization of the camera itself using various methods and tools. But the software step cuts the sharp margins and is not always good, introducing jitter and artifacts. Hardware optical stabilization is still rarity in smartphones and non-existent in the now beloved action cameras. Carry a Steadicam everywhere with you? My name is Dmitro Velosh and I think there is a much better way. The totally pocketable smartphone and action camera pendulum stabilizer, the Smoothie. The first important thing about it is the size. It is exceptionally light at only 125 grams and 19 centimeters or under 8 inches long when totally compacted. You don't have to plan to take it, you can just put it into your bag or even a pocket and pretty much forget about it. The second important thing is the ability to stabilize both smartphones and action cameras. Stabilization is especially important for action cameras, especially for abrupt and or quick camera slash operator movement. Let's take a closer look. On top of the stab, there is an adjustable cell phone holder with variable height. Pretty much any phone will fit here. Rotating rubber feet on the bottom of the holder can be rotated away from the phone's edge buttons. This is very important for horizontal balancing of the phone, as the phone itself has to be moved within the holder to balance it horizontally. You can replace the phone holding bracket with a smaller concentric tripod mount bracket. It has the standard tripod mount screw, though you will need an aqua box for pretty much all action cameras. The GoPros and many other popular cameras simply have no tripod mount on them at all, and the Xiaomi Yi and Yi 4K tripod mount screws are simply too much off center for the concentric thing to compensate. With the waterproof enclosure though, there are no problems whatsoever. There are three simple steps of setting this stabilizer up disregarding the device attached. First, you have to balance the phone or the action camera horizontally by moving it left or right within the holder till the stabilizer stops tilting. Second, stabilize the camera front to rear balance by tilting the front to rear hinge till the camera stops tilting front or rear. Three. Adjust the length of the boom arm holding the counterweight on its end. The length should be such that the rapid movements of the whole thing front, back, left or right don't tilt the camera end of the stabilizer to any direction. This is basically it, you can now use the stabilizer. You can adjust the handle tilt angle depending on the height of the point you want to shoot from, but this is solely for convenience. Interesting engineering decision, there are two strong magnets built in. One is in the stabilizer itself and another is in the handle, so you can pan the camera without touching it or the stabilizer having more contact points with the handle. Genius! Also here is a rubber leash, in case you have to make a faster movement by the camera or keep it steady during quick abrupt movement. All this without touching and hence shaking the camera. I think that a stabilizer of this kind is best suitable for any situation where you need a better than average video or when you plan a shoot, even a small amateur one. This thing would never stay unused. The price tag would not repel anyone either. This actually could be a perfect present. As long as you know that the person is shooting any kind of video, a thing like this is a perfect gift. This was Dmitro Voloshin and a cool video stabilizer for mobile devices, this movie. See ya!